welcome to my channel in today's videos I'm going to make some cream of wheat in Puerto Rico we call this farina and this is a half cereal in here it say it's gonna cook time is gonna be two minutes and a half but for my personal opinion it's gonna take longer than that this cereal have um, excellent source of iron and calcium and in Puerto Rico we make it with milk we never made this with water oh I'm not going to say whenever because I don't know, maybe some Puerto Rican do. I never um, done this with uh, with water. Um, when I was a little kid, my mother used to make it with, always with milk, okay? So here I have one third cup of um, cream of wheat. This is one third cup. I also have two cup of milk and the milk I'm using is 1% and you can use 2% if you want. And I'm going to put some vanilla extract. I'm going to put some cinnamon powder and a pinch of salt. And um, cinnamon and vanilla is completely optional. So if you're allergic to cinnamon, you don't have to, you don't have to add them, okay? And then you add the basic, which is going to be, oh, and we put sugar to taste. So I have two cup of milk, so in a medium saucepan, we're going to add the, uh, the milk. And I have my heat in medium high. And I'm going to add one teaspoon of vanilla. I'm going to add a pinch of salt. And I'm going to add the um the cinnamon powder and you can also if you have the stick cinnamon with the stick you can add them in there for flavor so like that much and then I'm gonna stir make sure um all the cinnamon is dissolved And I like it, my my granola wheel, I like it like kind of soft, but if you like a little bit thicker, you can add probably a little bit more of the uh, granola wheat, okay? I mean, I like it like creamy. That's what I'm, the word I'm using. And if you don't want to use regular sugar, you can use some of the um, endocolorants, like artificial flavor, like Splenda or, or Truvia or Stevia. Okay, so you can add that in there, and remember, um, you're not gonna add as much as the regular sugar. Now I'm going to add my sugar. I add two tablespoons and later on you can add more okay if you want um, I have one third cup of the granola wheat I'm gonna add that in there and then I continuously gonna stir this so now we're gonna lower the, the heat to medium because it's not let me remove it from the heat because my heat was a little bit too high. So if that happened, I'm not gonna edit this video, I'm just gonna show you the way it is, that way if that happened to you, you know what you have to do, just remove it from the heat, a little bit, because the heat was a little bit too high. So I just lower the heat to medium, and I'm gonna continue um, moving this until I have the consistency desired, okay? I'm going to let you know how long it took um, when my granola wheat is done. Just continue moving. The important thing is you're going to continue moving this because it's now you're going to have some lumps in your granola wheat. So at the end I'm going to show you the final result. Okay, and my granola wheat is done. It took approximately four to five minutes. and. This is the final result. You see, I like it real creamy, but if you like it more thicker, 
and you can you can put add a little bit more and sometimes you know um it's gonna have more consistency so what you can do is you can put one teaspoon or just a little bit of butter if you want to add some butter and if you add some butter you don't have to add the salt okay or you can sprinkle some of the cinnamon powder on top and this is optional for the extra flavor I'm gonna do it to one and here is the cream of wheat so this is mine so let me show you it's creamy but if you like it thicker absolutely you are welcome to add a little bit more so I hope you guys like this video if you like it thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed I invite you to my channel to subscribe and it's completely free for more videos and I also have this video in a, a Spanish version okay thank you until the next one bye okay as you see after probably five minutes later have more consistency it's not the um, soft it's creamy but it has consistency so I want you to take this in consideration because I want you when you made it say oh no I'm gonna keep adding no so you see that's what I show that way you can see the consistency okay